Subscribe to get carried and click on the bell icon for more updates. Everybody loves fried chicken, be it kids or adults. Today I'm going to show you my take of KFC style fried chicken at home. I'm going to cook the chicken in two stages, one by poaching it first and next by frying it. So here I've got about a litre of water that's coming to a boil. Now while that heats up, I'm going to add three onions that have been quartered. To this, I'm also going to add two bay leaves, two dried red chilies, three cloves of garlic, two to three cinnamon sticks, about five cloves, the juice of one lemon, a good amount of salt, that's about two and a half teaspoons of salt. I'm also going to add some peppercorns about 10 to 12 peppercorns and about half a teaspoon of coriander seeds. I'm just going to gently bash the peppercorns and the coriander seeds just to release their flavor. So the peppercorns and coriander seeds are bashed up. I'm just going to add these to the stock water. I have about five pieces of chicken drumstick with the skin on because that's what's going to give us really nice crispy chicken when we fry it. Now with this water boiling, I'm just going to drop the chicken pieces into the boiling water. I'm going to let the chicken cook in this stock water for about 14 minutes before we fry it off later to get our crispy KFC style chicken. It's been about 14 minutes and because you can't tell, it smells absolutely wonderful here. The chicken is poached. I'm just going to pull it out here and leave it on this plate to rest and of course cool before we can move on to dredging it. While the chicken is cooling down and the oil is heating up for us to fry the chicken, I'm going to go ahead and season the dredging or the coating for the fried chicken. I've got one cup of all-purpose flour here and one cup of instant oats. I'm just going to season both of these coatings. I'm going to start with a teaspoon of salt for the all-purpose flour, teaspoon of salt for the instant oats, half a teaspoon of black pepper powder, again first in the all-purpose flour, and then in the instant oats, a quarter teaspoon of red chilli powder, A quarter teaspoon of garlic powder in the all-purpose flour, quarter teaspoon of garlic powder in the instant oats and half a teaspoon of cumin powder. Now I'm just going to whisk all of these seasonings into the flour first. I've also got three eggs here which I'm just going to whisk. We're ready to start making the coating for the fried chicken. First comes the flour. I'm just going to take the chicken, dip it nicely into the flour. What this does is that it makes the chicken nice and dry. Shake off all the excess. Dunk it into the egg. And for that final stage of crispiness, it gets a coating of the instant oats. Now continue the same process for the rest of the pieces of chicken. Flour first into the egg and the last layer. The chicken is nicely coated in the flour, egg and instant oats. Now we're just ready to fry them off.
that's it the last of our fried chicken is ready to eat i'm just going to let this cool slightly before anyone can tuck into it this homemade kfc style chicken is made with a lot of tlc and i really hope you'll try this recipe soon and when you do leave a comment and subscribe to get curried for loads more such recipes